what's up welcome back i'm here to give y'all a quick little update on the car uh, i ain't do much since i've been back but i'm gonna show y'all what i did do just a quick little update not much give y'all a little walk around show you what's going on and we'll go from there all right so check this out this is how that look in there that shit look pretty nice to be honest i like the way it look I'm talking about the uh intake manifold and the uh, exhaust manifold that should look pretty good Imagine how it's gonna look with all the end lines running from that neck right there and all the end lines running to the fuel rail. It's gonna look good. Shit gonna look good for real. But by far, this has been by far the most complete the car has been since I got it. Look at that. Like Jesus shining on it. Yeah, probably the most complete it's been. The white's reflecting all the. Super clean, quick little walk around. Still gotta mount those right there, right there. That's the uh, new harness and all that. Still gotta mount it. We got boxes and boxes of parts in the back. Most of those parts are stuff like intake manifold gasket, exhaust manifold gasket. Um, I got a few other things in there as well, like the the bolts or the, the studs for the intake manifold. I need to order some for the exhaust manifold. That box is the headlights. The box right here. Those are the headlights. But it's coming along. For those of y'all who've seen this on my Instagram, uh, this was the um, turbo I had on my Evo. I'll look for the video, see if I throw it in here. See how it sounds. It sounded good as shit. Yeah, this was the turbo I had on it. It's a Borg Warner. It was a 362. Um, I made 680 on it. Yeah, I made 680 on this turbo right here when I had it. The compress the compressor wheel is right here. Well, what happened was. Um, the turbo went bad, and I had the turbo. I should just. What happened was the turbo went bad, and I had the turbo just sitting here, and I was trying to take this out, and I forgot it was reverse pitch, and I snapped it. So I was like, "Damn!" So I kept these. These was all the souvenirs that I kept from the Evo. But I was thinking of buying another center cartridge and just running this turbo. I really don't like how long this exhaust part is right here I probably just had to get that cut cut it off and like get that v-band moved down but I don't know if I want to do that I don't even know if I want to mess with the Borg Warners anymore I had issues with this one it kept smoking and shit just um I had multiple issues with this one I mean it was a good ass turbo don't get me wrong but I had to get it rebuilt within like a thousand miles I don't know if I did something wrong with it, it could have been my fault I didn't like you know do the turbo right but it made 680 on the Evo on the dyno just shit this spools quick as fuck too like this turbo spooled so damn fast under 5,000 rpm I was at full boost in the Evo basically so it was it was nuts but yep that's it not going to use it. I just keep it as a souvenir. I'm not going to say I'm not going to use it because I've been debating using it, just getting the center cartridge. But I kept it over the last couple of years, probably about three or four years now. I kept it as a souvenir. Um, on that, not much else going on with the car. 
other than what I told you, turbo manifold in, take manifold in. They'll still come out. I still got to put gasket and stuff in there, but it's just stuff. I like to place stuff where they go whenever I get it so I don't have to search for it. Put the car back on the ground just because I'm tired of it being on jack stands. But well, appreciate y'all stopping by. Like, share, and subscribe. Damn it, man. I want y'all to subscribe. Watch this build get better. Appreciate y'all, though. Thanks. Peace.